whiskey lovers and welcome to another one of Mark's Whiskey Ramblings and today again I've got my buddy Manny with me. That can mean only one thing, Mark and Manny's malts. Yay. Yeah, for 2017 Mark and Manny will, will release the Galaxy series. You will remember that last year when we started out we did the Animal series and we had four single cast releases. Yep. We had the Ape, the Tiger, the Python <laughs> and the Elephant. Which were basically a Krakalaki, a Tamdu, an Armorig, the first uh, independent bottling of that uh, French single malt, and finally a Kalila. But now, 2017 brings us the Galaxy series, and the first release in the Galaxy series is it's, here. Yeah, yeah, we've got it. We do, we do. It took a bit of, it took a bit of searching because, yeah. as you yeah. know, we always want to do something very special. Uh, this first release of the Galaxy series will have, well, Galaxy series is of course because we are mm -hmm. Star Wars fans. Yes. Uh, we didn't, what we, we thought it through uh, <laughs> and we, we will be putting some planets on the labels this time around. And the first planet is Saturn. Yeah. Why did we choose Saturn anyway? Oh, well, it's a, a god of agriculture. Right. The Romans. Right. Uh, agriculture, barley, whiskey. That's, that's the link. So you see, so, yeah. we did think about this. And our first release, we are very proud of this. Yeah. Our first release, as you can see, is an Aram. Aram, 20 years old, 1996. This is one of the very first 20-year-old Aram single cask, cask strength bottlings ever. Yeah. Yeah. So we're very proud of that one. We are. Um, and that's what we would like to present to you today. Uh, we've got 50 bottles again. It's always limited to 50 bottles. And this is going to be the new one. Bourbon cask matured and bottled at a whopping 54.1% yeah. ABV. Oh my God. Shall we give this one a try? Okay. All right, so the color is a, a sunlight to golden. It's bourbon cask matured on the nose. <sighs> Sorry. <laughs> oh man. This is, this is, this is good, this is a Fruit. This is. Yeah. It's creamy on the on, on butterscotch, some banana, coconut. Yeah, some light brown sugar. You know, like the the, the griffe sugar. The, the we call it child sugar, the one you put on your pancakes. Oh yeah. But it becomes quite fruity indeed. It becomes a bit of a fruit cocktail. You get some some peach and some 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 pineapple in there, some gooseberries, coconut, like you said. Yeah. It becomes quite exotic. I get some mango, some oranges. This is a little bit of a fruit bomb. It is, it is. 54.1% ABV. Yeah, but it doesn't show on the nose. No, it doesn't. I wonder if it will on the palate. Oh, yeah. Mm -hmm. mm. Perfect arrival with a bit of a spicy kick to it. And yeah, you can tell it's 54.1% ABV. Yeah, it has a bite, but... But I don't feel like... No. I need to add water to this. No, I don't. Not at all. No. Mm. Mm. But it's mostly mm. juicy and fruity. Again, this is, this is quite... This is like, like everything you would like to... Everything you would expect from a good fruit cocktail is in there. Only, you know, drenched in alcohol. <laughs> <laughs> For the better version. <laughs> yeah, the better version. It's it's in, in, in that is in that sense it is quite a good continuation of what you get on the nose. Yep. Yeah. It's got a nice depth to it as well. But this is this is a fruit bomb again. This is very fruity indeed. I love it. Mm. The finish. Mm -hmm. mm. It's wonderfully long. And it remains juicy and fruity, but the peppery is the peppery touch is there in the back of the throat at the end. Warm and soothing, long, it lovely. Is. Oh wow! Yeah. There's not a trace of wood in here. No, not at all. Not a trace of wood. No. Well, except except for the spices maybe, but there's no dryness, no oakiness at all. Uh, it's all about sweetness. It's all about fruitiness. It's all about well, aram. <laughs> aram is simply in this case. Wow, this is, uh, well, it's a wonderful around that would, uh, and I think this is the perfect dram to have with dessert for, for with pastry, for example. Oh, yeah. This, yeah. this would do very well uh, with pastry. Uh, very proud of this one. Money, money, what, what do you think? 
<laughs> Another one? No, 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 that's not what I meant. Ah, what I <laughs> Oh, we'll have more than just one other one. But again, this is again, and, and that's where we are true to our credo of, uh, of uh, Mark and Manny's Malls. It is limited to 50 bottles only. Yeah. Once they're gone, they're gone. And uh, you can only find them at malls.com. Uh, we'll show it again at the bottom of the screen. 50 bottles only, but it will be gone in a flash, I'm sure. Yeah. Around 20 years old, 1996. Did we already tell you how proud we are of this one? We are, we are very, very proud, proud of this one, aren't we? And uh, we are on the lookout now for the next uh, single cast bottling. We are thinking about it, we're looking at cast samples, and we will come back to you with a new uh, Mark and Manny's malt uh, in the near future. But for now, please enjoy this Aran, 20 years old, 1996, from Mark and Manny's malt. And until then, may the malt be with you. Bye-bye.